The primary and foremost goal of every being in this universe, especially our planet, is survival. Nature has provided humans with the intelligence to keep up their monotonous routine for survival. Likewise, animals also thrive for the same strategy. However, these blessings sometimes turn against them and become a hindrance or sometimes to hurt themselves so severely that they may lose their life. Here's a list of animals that seem to kill themselves by their own body parts. Welcome to Top 10 World. Hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon if you haven't already. And now, without further ado, let's dig right into the meat. Number 7. Sheep's Wool Growth In these modern times, some people are of the view that shearing a sheep is cruel. However, there's a great benefit in it for the sheep itself that makes us want to say that it's cruel not to shear a sheep. The reason behind it is that domestic sheep are unable to shed their natural winter coats. This woolen stuff adds up respectively if not removed in time, causing the sheep to die of heat exhaustion during the hot months. Moreover, these increased wool layers also impact their versatility and cause wrinkles on their skin that collect urine and moisture. Attracted to the moisture, flies lay eggs in the folds of the skin and the hatched maggots can eat the sheep alive, eventually leading the poor animal to its death. A sheep named Chris got lost in the wild years ago and his wool never stopped improving. So when shears finally removed it, they collected a record-shattering 89 pounds worth of the fluffy stuff. Number 6. Argali Sheep Horns This six-year-old is finally ready to compete. His opponent is a- Argali is the Mongolian word for sheep. It's also known as the mountain sheep and is one of the giant breeds of sheep found on the planet. Despite being famous for their meat, they're also known for their long horns that are mainly corkscrew shaped, and the male sheep use them to fight each other. However, these horns bring a tragic fate upon the poor animal. With the increasing age of the sheep, the horns also grow bigger until they reach a size able to pierce through the cheekbone, and the sheep could die because of their deadly horns. This is an example that empowers the statement that nourishment of not everything is good. Number 5. Babarusa Fangs Babarusas are no standard pigs. Found within the swamps and rainforests of Indonesian islands, babarusas have barrel-shaped bodies adjusted on delicate deer-like legs. The only well-known species of the babarusa is recognized by its bare body and gigantic bending tusks. As evolutionary mystery, the canines of a male babarusa never stop growing and eventually pierce out and end up penetrating the unfortunate animal's skull in some cases that can kill them. These canines are very delicate to hunt or forge and often break during fights for a female. Even some animals have to pay a heavy price for simping. Just kidding. Number 4. The Donkey's Hooves From ancient times till this modern one, humans have used donkeys for various purposes. It's a beautiful animal but suffers a lot from health issues, including its hooves. Donkey's feet are very different from horses' hooves as they've adapted to survive in a dry environment. Donkeys thrive in semi-arid parts of the world where the ground is dry and stony. Their feet are much more efficient than horses at absorbing water. Most donkeys will require a foot trim every 6 to 10 weeks, but care should be taken with older donkeys who might struggle to lift their legs. It would be best if you aim to keep the limbs as low as possible during trimming. If a donkey's foot becomes overgrown, you should obtain a radiograph before trimming to check for any changes to the bone within the hoof. A vet should also be consulted for pain relief. Let's take a little breather here so you can smash that like button. It doesn't involve evading death, though. Getting back to the meat. Number 3. Buck's Antlers Easy. Bucks have antlers which grow from their pedicle, or base, new each summer and fall off each winter. Horns do not fall off, they grow continually from the base getting larger or longer each year. As the daylight length increases in the spring, bucks start to grow antlers from their pedicles on top of their head. The antler is a bone, one of the fastest growing bones in the animal kingdom. 
Growing antler is covered with unique capillary packed skin called velvet to supply it with the nutrients and minerals it needs. When the antler is fully grown, the velvet is rubbed off and the antler is polished by rubbing against tree branches. However, they also use their antlers to fight against each other and subsequently the antlers get stuck and fight to exhaustion until they die. An unfortunate event happened where three bucks got stuck during a fight and drowned, eventually meeting their fate. Number two, tortoise's shell. A question that crosses one's mind is how a tortoise ended up on its back stands up again. Tortoises are particularly susceptible, being unable to flip themselves by twisting their bodies inside their shells. It's a deadly serious matter. Being able to right itself counts as one of life's epic struggles, a potential case of life and death. Female tortoises develop bigger than males, maybe since the greater they are, the more practical descendant they can create. An advantage that exceeds the hazard of not being able to get up when looking at the world the wrong way. Male tortoises confront a distinctive dilemma. Smaller guys are more active and their more prominent versatility may permit them to find and mate with more females. But male tortoises like to battle each other by effectively attempting to flip their rivals onto their backs. Once on their back, they're prone to many dangers like malnutrition that indicates starving to death without help or being a potential prey to predators. Number 1. Sloth, the slowest animal. Sloths are known to be one of the lazy and slowest animals in the animal kingdom. They're so passive that algae settle on their fur. It helps them to camouflage in their respective habitat. They're built for treetops for life and spend most of their time up in the canopy, coming down only one time per week to relieve themselves. The trees provide natural protection from predators such as jaguars and eagles. It's safer for sloths to remain motionless and camouflaged off the ground. They will, however, venture down on rare occasions to find more food or a mate. They also sleep a lot, napping around 15 to 20 hours a day. On average, sloths travel 41 yards per day, less than half the length of a football field. However, on the ground, the frail hind legs are powerless and their long claws are a hindrance, and they must use their forehead claws to move forward, dragging their bellies. If trapped on the ground, they're pretty much prone to predators and are unable to escape. So guys, that was our list of animals having body parts that can cause their fatality. Do let us know which one you found the most interesting. Do give your feedback in the comments section as we love to hear from you. And finally, that's been it from our side. If you enjoy our content, do consider subscribing and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, peace.